and see Dr. Smith. Hmm. I'm just so impressed by the number of statistics and something like 700 papers that you continually churn out. Mm -hmm. um, so I was going to call you the diva of data. I like that. <laughs> right? We could tweet or that. Or yeah. rock star of research. <laughs> um, you have said that when Hollywood wants something to succeed, it will. So Absolutely. advise us, please. Star Wars, The Force yeah. Awakens. Yeah. I mean, yeah. that's really what we're talking about. The two lead characters. You put production, you put marketing, you, you give a vision to a team, and you support them, much like what Lydia's articulating, and you watch the international box office roll in with a female lead, right? Mm -hmm. And a sidekick from an underrepresented racial or ethnic group, if not a couple, right? So, so, but what I think is really important is when we're talking about statistics and we're talking about what sells, Female leads also are usually associated with lower productions. And male leads are usually associated with greater productions. And female leads... As in budget? Yeah, or? yeah, yeah. Okay. And, and then they're released on fewer screens if you have a female lead or co-lead. And if you have a male lead, it's on more screens. So it's not gender that's driving what happens. It's the production. It's the marketing. It's the distribution density. So the only thing that's limited here is the imagination of storytellers. And a team behind them can make it sell. A decent film with a lot of money behind it can actually do really well. And in our team, we're constantly perpetuated by how do you get a 35, 40% Metacritic score and kill it at the box office? You don't have a very good story, but there's a lot of money behind it. And that's the key. Money is often associated implicitly with being female, right? Judith, you can talk to finance and gender, right? And there's a bias, and we need to uncouple that bias so that more individuals have the opportunity to tell diverse stories that represent the world globally that we live in. Mm -hmm.